when I have hope in Christ, I have hope that that promise of repentance and atonement um, is really valid, that I can really actually become better. Sometimes I just feel like uh, no matter what I do, I'm just still not doing it right. And, um, and that's like so discouraging sometimes, especially when the mistakes that we make hurt other people. I think we can have hope that Christ will allow us to fix the things about ourselves or to forget or overcome the things about ourselves that hold us back and keep us from accomplishing those projects. Thank you, Melissa. You know, it's interesting how life experience teaches us. Um, I love how, you know, being a, being a parent often teaches you about my relationship with deity as I look down on my children. I, several years ago, my, my daughter, she was three, and uh, she had a really bad accident at our, at our home. And uh, she had to be rushed to primaries. And so she's in the hospital room and she has all these like tubes hooked up to her. Oh no. It was, it was awful, you know, and, and I'm just, and she's terrified. She's only three, right? So just me and my little girl, you know, and, and she, she, looks, she looks over at me and, and she kind of tears come out of her eyes and she says, she says, dad, don't leave me. And so, so here I'm holding her hand. Of course, in my, in my mind, I'm like, of course, there's no way I'm going to leave you. It was, it was at that moment. It was just this moment of clarity as I'm holding her hand, thinking to myself, I would never leave you. And that, that testimony of my was strengthened. And that's what God does. He holds our hand and he's not going to leave us. And so we have this beautiful image in, image in, in Isaiah of Christ just holding our hand, telling us it's going to be okay. That's the hope. Then whatever we're going through in life, that there is, there is hope in, in, in salvation. There is hope when we're trying to overcome a sin or a temptation or anything that life throws at us. There is hope in Christ. An unfailing source of hope is knowing who we are. And you talked about that relationship with your daughter. And I think when we understand soul deep that we are sons and daughters of God, that should bring us great hope. 